So, greetings YouTube, um, this is Sama. Um, today I've come to you with a um, unboxing review. Um, we'll be unboxing this rather sexy, lovely looking orange CR20 LDX Crush Picks. Oh, that's a brilliant name, very memorable. Um, it's got a built in tuner and digital effects, and it's 20 watt. And if you don't know what Orange do, um, and you don't know what an Orange Crush is, it's a guitar app. Um, it's not a computer or um, anything like that, but there you have it. Um, and it's not certainly not a fruit. Um, so, on with the unboxing. So, um, I bought this on a whim. I was at um, Hotbox, and basically I want a practice amp I want an amp that does really great cleans. Um, I've seen a lot of reviews about the Orange Crush, and from what I heard, it, they do like really great cleans. And I wanted something to use um, live. It's going to sound really funny, but I want a super clean um, amp um, live. Um, and I thought I'd use this um, in, with my EVH5150 just for cleans. Um, I just have to try it out. I've got a gig on Saturday. I'll see how it pans out, I'll just try it out. I mean, nobody's going to come see me play, are they? Didn't say that. Okay, so a bit of cardboard, a bit of cardboard, uh, European lead, okay, that's fine. A bit more stuff. Um, Doke. So you've got your owner's manual right here. A please buy some more orange stuff from last year. Different things, um, different amps. Um, some angry looking blokes, some hairy looking blokes. Lots of hair, lots of clothes, lots of guitars. Um, Jim Brew, okay. Um, bag with some like a gel and um, um, so no I didn't find an orange in my uh, orange box I've got this orange which is slightly different um, so basically it's your atypical uh, practice amp, um, it's got loads of stuff in it that you could use and um, I will we'll put a video up um, just showing you, talking you through the various settings that you've got on there. Um, so you start with your input jack, you've got a, um, a knob for gain, then you've got one for overdrive, you've got your typical controls, so you've got mid, you've got high, mid, um, low, then you've got your volume, You've got an auxiliary um, in case you wanted to play along to the track, and then you've got a phone jack, which is brilliant. And you've got the section underneath that, nice and easy um, to go along to, which is the effects um, effect level. And then you've got your tuner, integrated tuner. Um, so um, the tuner is quite easy to look at. It's just it's just go, it goes from the C um, two lights for OK. And then it tells you if it's sharp or not, that's fine. And then you've got your effects mode, you've got various different effects. Um, reverb all the way to vibrato, um, which I'm not particularly fond of. Um, I like vibrato, I think I like it better than chorus. Um, but we'll see, we'll just have a level. And then it's got an effects level for all the digital effects that you can put in there. And um, I've had to play around with it, a band practice, and I've actually managed to put it on a nice sort of delay. I think I'm using a delay which is 175 milliseconds. Um, that one in the 300 milliseconds. Um, and it goes up all the way to 650 milliseconds, so it's nice, nice, nice sounding digital delay. Um, in case you didn't get that, that's nice, nice, nice sounding digital delay. So, pretty much um, turn it on at the back. Um, doesn't shout out that it's noisy or anything, so that's good.
nice loud clear. I'll just sort of turn everything down to about sort of nine o'clock, so like one sort of out of ten, it's about three. Um, um, so yeah. just after 12 o'clock. Um, also it comes with a overdrive channel. So this is what it sounds like on its own. Thank you. 
Um, there's lots of effects on it as well to go through. Um, so, like I said, I particularly liked the delay, so that's number seven. Uh, turn the effects level up. built-in overdrive channel um, just turn it down a little bit um, so what I've got on my pedal board I've just got uh, just set up so that I could have clean sounds um, going through this one so milliseconds and my MXR regains on 9 o'clock, mixes on 9 o'clock and delays on 12 o'clock because uh, I like it a bit more subtle um, and it's just completely clean, There's, the gain is on sort of 10 o'clock and the volume is on between 9 and 10 um, this, you know, it's fairly decent, fairly decent, I sort of like it yeah.
good. Um, just my um, overdrive. sound good through this um, and it's definitely definitely a good good little amp and highly recommended not recommended for the overdrive channel on that one orange sort that one out um, all right catch you later guys have fun <laughs>